All right, guys, we're back with another Edison Format Finals at Epic Cards and Games. We got uh, David Provence on the left playing Machina Gadgets and Mario on the right playing the Mach Machina Ryko Hamster Control. So a machine, kind of a machine mirror match, but two different engines. Ryko Hamster versus Gadgets. Uh, this is, both these guys have been on the channel before. David's been in the, David's won once on the channel. Mario's going for his fourth win right now. Mario's been in, uh, this is like his eighth final, so he's pretty familiar face. So, looks like Mario set Raikou turn one, which sometimes you have to in this deck because it plays Pot of Avarice. I just don't like doing this play in Bayou. And this deck's a little different. So, he pops the yellow gadget and then sets a back row. Mario summons Lila and decides to attack him first. Okay. Oh, see? Ooh, is this going to come back to bite him? Ugh. We'll see if it does. I don't like sending heavy storm. I, I get it. Sometimes you can catch people with it, but me, I, I just don't like doing it. All right, now David sits one. One thing I will say about David. Yeah, see, I kind of made the read on average. One thing I'll say about David, he's his, his record at our locals is like insane. Like He makes the finals almost every every time he enters. I think I lost track how many times he's been in the finals. Let me go scroll real quick. He doesn't show up all often, but when he does, he somehow just makes it to the finals. I think it's right here. This is his fifth finals, but he's only won once. The other three times, he's gotten second. So, yeah, he's one in three in the finals. Maybe he can get a second win here. So, all right. Mario set. What do you, what do you think he set? Either Ryko or a hamster. Hamster would hurt David unless if he has solidarity in hand. Did I mess up life points? I was kind of ranting, so I don't know if. Uh... Ooh, Soul Taker in the main deck. That's probably for the dupe block. I think that's why he's main decking that. He's got Avarice. Oh, he does have solidarity. Yeah, you need to play that. In case that's a hamster down there. Oh, no, he attacked over the Lila, right? Yeah, so he he has not taken any damage. So it is hamster. But that thing will run over the hamster. Now hit over Raikou. So what's Mario going to pop? The back row or the solidarity? I don't, or maybe he could pop a gadget. Who knows? I hope he doesn't, but I don't think so. All right. So you can tell he's debating. So he chooses the back row. Mills three more monsters. Card Trooper and a few others. All right. See, this Raiko, Raiko hamster decks. Oh, another Avarice. If you have to attack into their monsters, it's pretty hard deck to it's pretty hard to beat this deck. It's like I think. Mario should be favoring this matchup. Same thing with like Diva Hero Beat. Diva Hero Beat struggles against decks like this. All right, so he played two averages on him. Because like your monsters are big, but you're just walking right into Mario's hands with gadgets. It's like, oh, you have to attack my Rikos and my hamsters, and I'm going to slowly wither away your resources. And this is a really unfortunate for David that he's main decking Cyber Dragon. This this just unfortunate. But it's not bad because you don't really have many targets for... Actually, I don't think it's a bad main deck card. And yeah, that should be game. Quick game one by Mario. Yeah, I, I think it's a good it's a good tech card because... It's good against Hero Beat. It's good against Black Wings. It's okay against Vayu. And obviously, if you play the mirror, it's insane. So it's not it's not a bad main deck card. And you don't play a lot of machines like gadgets do. So you could just pitch it for Fortress, worst case scenario. So I can see why he's main decking it. So here, David Provencal, Nobleman's the hamster. Oh, yeah, he does play three. <laughs> that I, I, I'd only play two, but Mario's like adamant on three hamster. And he plays charge, too? I just noticed that. Wow. 
but no gadgets for David or gear frames. And I think he plays nine gadgets plus three gear frame. It's 12 copies. And he didn't open a single one. And he just drew heavy. Yeah, this is unfortunate for David. Now, he might be playing more than 40 cards. I know in the past, I've done a deck profile of his gadget deck from a few months ago. And he was playing more than 40. So here, Mario set Raiko. And it looks like David can't really do much except set cards so he doesn't have to discard yeah his hand is oh he has a cyber dragon mm. so he pops the transmigration he knows mst oh no he wants to hold that cyber dragon for when mario goes off i get it caius So he hits for 200 first, then he's probably going to drop a Caius. He kind of gave away that he has Caius, so he better he better summon it. Oh, he didn't summon it? Oh, he should have summoned it. No, he should have. I think he should have. Now he probably knows you have Caius. And can you protect the Raikou? Can you drop the Caius next turn? So David's got bottomless, heavy. I can tell he doesn't want to drop the Cyber Dragon. What did he what did he draw for his turn? Man, David's hand sucks. Maybe Avarice is not worth it in gadgets. It's like such a bad draw early game. It might not be worth it. Okay, so he fortress for fortress, so he still has a cyber dragon. Ooh, Mario does not have a D prison, and here he takes 23. If Mario has the Kai's, I think he... I, we'll see what that back row is that David set. Maybe he's scared of pulling the rug. That's why he didn't want to drop the Raikou. I mean, sorry, the Kai's. But I still think he should have done it. What's a free Raikou? Raikou already did his job, right? Got rid of the transmigration prophecy. All right, does David slam down heavy to try and, and just get rid of those back rows? It looks like he does. It was Torrential, Bottomless, Mirror Force. So, yeah, he would have Torrential to Caius, I guess. And he drops Fortress. Oh, this is game. This is game. Oh, no, but he's got the Gores. So he takes 33 with a 3,300 token. So he can run over the Gores, right? Yeah. Okay. So he runs over the Gores, but Mario's got a 3,300 token. Ooh, that Gore saved him. So what's left in David's hand? Avarice and another card. I can't remember what the other card was. So Mario's at 24 to David's 7,800, which I'm pretty sure he's got Caius in hand. Oh, David's last card is Cyber Dragon. Yeah, he's got Cyber Dragon and Avarice. How many monsters? But yeah, Avarice is dead. So, and Mario's got a bunch of cards. What do you do if you're Mario? If Mario has his own Cyber Dragon, it's it's a blowout. So he chooses to drop Fortress. So he can wipe. This is this is an interesting scenario. Like. Maybe he should have dropped the fortress and defense. I mean, heavy storm is gone now. Okay, so he decides to heavy his solidarity. Set two. Oh, here comes Caius. So he gets rid of one of the fortresses and now plays his avarice. One, two, three. Four, five. So yeah, maybe him holding the Caius kind of saved him. Because then all the problem was David had to heavy storm when he did the when he went for game. I don't blame him. This was an area where I feel like David's hand just sucked. Charge. He already normal summon Mills Rug. 
that's one of the reasons I feel like you can't play gadgets. Triple everyone's side decking like triple pull in the rug <laughs> for frogs and and then you're just caught in the crossfire playing gadgets. Okay, so uh, Mario searches Lila. So what's he gonna do? Probably hit with the token, right? To get over the fortress. And then we'll see what David decides to pop. Oh, he had a plague? I didn't even know. Oh, he milled the plague. Oh, wow. Now he can make Stardust and just... Oh, yeah, this this is not good. Everyone hates that all, the new art Stardust. <laughs> okay, he takes 800 and negates with Stardust. So 7,000 to 24. And we know David's hand is dead. It's not looking good for our boy David. It is not looking good. He's got a dead avarice, a cyber dragon, and whatever. Oh, he drew a gadget. A little late, but... Maybe you, like, special cyber dragon. What are you at, 7,000? So that, I think that's what Dave is debating. I think you special cyber in defense mode. Oh, but rug just... Okay, now you can special the Cyber Dragon. But David has just decided to scoop. Yeah, his hand was just not good. So congrats, Mario. Again, his fourth win. And David, fourth, second place, man. <laughs> Crazy, man. Maybe you'll get the win next time. I'm rooting for you, man. He did win once on the channel with gadgets, though. Um, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that duel. And we'll be back soon for another tournament. Bye, guys.